this video, we'll explain the steps to connect a personal electronic device, or PED, to the GDL60 to achieve wireless connectivity functionality. The GDL60 allows for Bluetooth and Wi-Fi connectivity. Crews should connect to Bluetooth first, as it allows easy login to the Crew Wi-Fi network within Garmin Pilot. Crew Wi-Fi is required to access all GDL60 capabilities from multiple devices, including flight plan transfer, database concierge, engine instrumentation system data, position data, Sirius XM audio control, and satellite phone service use. Start on the GTNXI homepage. Select System. Select Connect Setup. Select GDL60 Setup. Select Networks and Pairing. Select Settings and Pair on the Crew Network line. From this page, you can view the device name for the GDL60. On your personal electronic device, or PED, open your device and go to the Bluetooth menu. Select the Bluetooth name that matches the Bluetooth name on the GTNXI. A Bluetooth pairing request will appear on the PED and GTNXI simultaneously. If the passkey matches on both screens, select Pair and Yes to accept the pairing request. If you want the PED to automatically reconnect to the GDL60 every time it's detected in the vicinity, ensure Enable Auto Reconnect is underlined in green. If using an Android device, after successfully pairing with the GDL, reopen the Garmin Pilot application and select the GDL60 from the device's page. Then select the Bluetooth connection of the GDL60 you just connected to from the drop down menu. Note if you don't see the GDL60 in your Garmin Pilot devices list, either on Android or iOS, make sure your device is running the latest Garmin Pilot version. As mentioned before, Bluetooth login is best for crew use only because it allows for pass through connection to the crew Wi Fi. Crew Wi Fi allows for higher bandwidth so that all GDL60 functions can be broadcast to multiple PEDs. However, staying on Bluetooth only may be best for one crew member on the ground during preflight. This way, the PED may be simultaneously connected to a hangar or FBO Wi-Fi for data while uploading or modifying the flight plan information of the aircraft through the GDL60. To pass through Connect to Wi-Fi, select the Connect icon at the top of Garmin Pilot. Select the line that says GDL60, use aircraft Wi-Fi for better performance and functionality. The connection to the GDL60 can easily be verified. On the GTNXI, go to the Networks and Pairing page and select Devices. From this page, you can see the connection status of all PEDs and if they are connected through Bluetooth or Wi-Fi.